got a grant from the Euros funding. Now, I'm quite passionate about playing football through your whole life. So this was all about getting slightly older, older people playing that may not have necessarily played before, or if they had, they would have a, a safe way to come back into playing football. I wanted to show that we could do a, a form of football that was, that was safe, relatively risk-free in terms of injury, but it's really good for health and fitness and you know the, the social side. Karen's positive and supportive. She doesn't tell you you're doing things wrong. She tells you how to do things better. We all went to a session down on Hove Lawns and showcased walking football as part of the Euros. That was amazing. I mean, you know, having the stadium and having the local games is just so brilliant. That's the atmosphere, full house, yeah. isn't it, of yeah, just women brilliant. fans, whereas yeah. we hadn't been to a single women's match before that. The things we were really passionate about was making sure that we didn't just deliver a football session, but social is really important. We sit and we drink coffee and we talk, and we talk about football, but we also talk about life, experiences and some of the issues that we're having in life at the minute, and somebody will always come back and say, oh yeah, well I dealt with that. They go do quiz nights, and they go to watch bands, and so it's that, that whole friendship and support that's a really important part of the, the group. It really does back a lot of depression with other women that have gone through sort of like menopause yes. and yeah. things like that. It's really boosted there. Well it's the friendship, it's the fun, it's the fitness. We're more than happy for people to come down and give football a try in a safe and supportive environment. This is women supporting women. Go ahead!